Hi and hello people. Welcome back once again to our channel, Bagai Academy of Mathematics. This session, we have a problem from CAT 2022 and this is from the concept of permutation and combination. Let us see what question we have with us. The number of integers greater than 2000 that can be formed with the digits 0, 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5 without repeating the digits is going to be what? We have the options. So the question seems to be not much complicated. Let's see the approach how we can solve this problem. Okay. Yes. Now, first of all, we are going to form integers and what digits we have with this? We have the digits. Let's take a note of it. Okay. We have the digits 0, 1, 2, 3, 4 and then 5. So there are uh, totally 6 digits available with this. And please note it very carefully. There is one 0 also. There is one 0. And other five non-zero digits we have with this. Now with this we need to form what? We need to form the integers and very clearly we have to form integers which are greater than 2000. Okay. Let's see this also. This condition is very important to uh, note here. So we need to form integers greater than 2000. So how many such integers we can form? This is going to be the question. So it's going to be very simple only. Now the moment you come to understand the integer we form should be greater than 2000 that means we can form either four digit numbers right we can form four digit numbers four digit numbers or my number can be a five digit number five digit number and we can also have a six digit number because totally we have six digits available with us so it can even be a six digit number okay yes now we have to individually find how many numbers we can form from each of these types this is what we need to do okay and remember our number cannot be lesser than four digits i mean what i come to tell is the number of digits cannot be less than four why because we cannot have a three digit number two digit number because a three digit number or two digit number cannot be greater than 2000 and obviously total itself we have only six digit and we cannot go beyond six digit that is a small logic very simple logic we can understand yeah coming one by one first we'll start from four digit numbers that means let me put four slots clearly one 2, 3 and 4. Yes, fine. Yes. Now we have to form 4 digit numbers. My number should be greater than 2000 which means think about this first digit. This can be filled with what numbers? I can fill this digit with either 2 or 3 or 4 or 5 only. Is it or not? Obviously 0 cannot come here because we are forming a 4 digit number. And we cannot even fill this slot with the digit 1. Because if we start from 1, the number will become 1000 and something, which means it will be definitely less than 2000. So that means I can take this slot, I can fill this only with a digit which is 2 or more than 2. That is what is the logic. Okay, yes. That means 1, 2, 3, 4. We have got 4 ways to fill this first digit. So 4 ways, right? Yes, fine. Now what about the next digit? This can be filled with how many ways? Hereafter, there is no condition at all. These digits can be filled with any number of number of ways okay but provided we should not repeat the digits that also given there in the question we have to take that also importantly now when i come here how many digits are left with us out of the totally six digit already one digit took this place which means i will be left with five more digits so this can be filled with five ways and what about this one this third place third digit can be filled in four ways and then this fourth digit can be filled in three ways is it or not so four into five into four into three ways we will be able to fill the numbers okay so that means uh, let's try to get the total the total will be what we are filling all the digits right so multiply everything so five into four into and then four into three so this will be nothing but 240 is it or not because this is 20 80 83 is are 240 so 240 so 240 four digit numbers we can form with this collection now come to five digit numbers. Five digit means put five slots now. One, two, three, four, five. We are going to fill with five slots. Now again, come here to the first digit. This can be filled in how many different ways? I can fill this first slot in how many ways? There's no condition here, okay? Because when I form a five digit number, definitely it will be greater than 2000, okay? Yes. Now all I have to think is I need to form a five digit number with this given collection. Now think about this place. This can be filled only with a non-zero digit because the moment you fill a zero here, it will no more be a five digit number. That's the reason, right? So that means this we have to fill with the non-zero digit only. How many non-zero digits are available with this? There are five non-zero digits. 
So five ways with which I can fill this. Next, here when you come to the second slot, when you come here, here of this, there's no condition at all. Okay. Any one of the any one of the remaining digits can occupy here. That means we are now when we come here, we have four non-zero digits and one zero is also there. That means this can be filled with again five ways. So five ways to fill this. Now reduce one by one. When I come here, there will be four more digits left over. So four ways to fill this. Here three ways and here two ways. Now multiply everything. You will be able to get the answer. So this will give you how much? Just multiply carefully and see the answer. So five into five into four itself will give you a hundred. Is it or not? So this itself will give you a hundred because this is twenty-five fours are hundred. And we have a three twos are. This is a six. So hundred six are. We will have six hundred. So that means we can totally form. 600 five digit numbers last one six digit numbers and how many ways we can construct a six digit number i will make six slots now so six slots now again we are going to do the same thing okay start from the first digit as usual this can be filled in how many ways we can fill this in only five ways because i have only five non zero digits because we need to form a six digit number i have to start with a non zero digit only so this can be filled in five ways and what about this one next It is same like the above. So here, when I come here, this is also five ways. Here four ways. Here three ways. Here two ways, and finally only one way for the last slot. Okay. So I hope you are able to understand this also. So now, when I multiply everything, all these things will again happen to get the same product six hundred only. Is it or not? So that means we can form totally six hundred six digit numbers. Now get the total. So totally, how many numbers we are able to form which are greater than two thousand? So greater than two thousand is what we have all these three possibilities. Now get the total. Add everything. So the answer will be what? Six hundred plus six hundred will give you thousand two hundred. Thousand two hundred plus two forty will give you thousand four hundred and forty. And it is matching exactly with your option A. So option A one four four zero is going to be the answer for your this particular question. Okay. Yes. So I hope the way we solved the approach, everything is clear to you. Any doubts you have, you can just leave it in the comment box. When I see it, I'll see to rectify it. Again we'll catch up in the next session with some other interesting question see you soon there thank you so much